Hi, this is a quick video tutorial to show members of the OCDSB how you can have posts that arrive into your organization or school's Google Groups conference forwarded to you in your inbox that you normally check every day for Gmail or email. And uh, once you get this set up, you won't have to go and visit the, the group conferences anymore. Everything should just be all in one place. It's going to start here back in your Gmail account. By the way, if this goes too fast, feel free to pause and rewind to go over any of the steps, but I'll move pretty briskly through these steps. Stage one, just getting to the groups. That grid up in the top right corner of your Gmail account or your Gmail interface is going to let you go down to any Google Apps, including more, and under more you'll find groups, and it'll open it up in a new tab. We're going to start by setting up the forwarding by going to My Groups in the top left corner, and where it says there's any groups we've been subscribed to, in this case mine is John McRae, I'm going to change no email to all email so that it'll forward posts from now on to my email account. Uh, the next thing to do before we leave this though is to click on the uh, conference itself and go over to the right and look for About, and under About, highlight and copy the email address associated with that group. It's going to come in handy in a second. But now I'm going to close the tab and go back to Gmail. Now under Gmail I'm going to set up a filter that when things arrive in this email from that group it's going to categorize them and get them away from my normal inbox. Go over to the gear and look for settings. Under settings look for filters and under filters, I'll delete this because I've already made one here, I'm going to go down to the bottom and create a new filter for this sort of thing. Anything that comes from a group is going to have a specific to in, uh, entry under its to field. So I'm going to paste anything that has been made to the group. And we're not quite done yet. We have to go over to the bottom right and create a filter with this search. And we're going to check two of the options. We're going to skip the inbox. We're going to apply a label. And we're going to go click under choose label and make something new. The new label, I'm going to call this one JMSS conference and say create. I'm also going to apply this. I happen to have gotten some of these posts before my mailbox so I'm going to check this and apply this filter to the matching ones. Create filter. It goes through and it's created this new filter and now you can go back to your inbox and you should no longer, if you followed all these steps, see any of those posts from the conference but you'll see them if you go down to its label down here. So they've been categorized and separated out from your regular email. One more thing I kind of like to do is I'm going to click the little down arrow and choose a label color for this just to make them a little more distinctive. And you'll see that, you won't see it under inbox, but if you go to more and all mail, you can see any items that have been flagged as being part of the conference. And that's it. You have just set up the forwarding from the group to your email. Part two is going to show you how you can organize your Gmail screen so it'll even keep all these things more organized and more intuitive. We'll see you there.